hey what's going on you guys this is madam and i'm coming back to you once again this time we're gonna go over to espn and this is about Am alabama forward darius miles he's been charged with capital murder um i will definitely list the article writer in the description as i always do but it says alabama men's basketball darius miles and another man have been charged with capital murder in connection with a Sunday morning shooting near the campus that killed a 23-year-old woman. Miles was booked into the Tuscaloosa County Jail around 6.45 p.m. Eastern Time on Sunday. A jail official told ESPN in a statement Sunday, the university said Miles, a junior reserve forward from Washington, D.C., is no longer on the team. Tuscaloosa Police Captain Jack Kennedy said the shooting occurred early early Sunday morning in a strip off of University Boulevard near campus. He said uh, Jama Harris of Birmingham of the Birmingham area was shot and killed. Miles, age 21, and Michael Lynn Davis, age 20, of Charles County, Maryland, were both charged with capital murder. The charge arose because the death involved shots fired into a vehicle, Kennedy said. At the time, it appeared that only the, the only motive uh, was a minor altercation that these individuals had with the victim as they were out on the strip, Kennedy said at a news conference Sunday evening. They, have, they didn't have... A previous relationship he said he said the driver of another vehicle in which Harris was a passenger approached campus police near Bryant Denny Stadium at about 1 45 a.m. saying someone had been someone had shot into the vehicle and he fired back one of the suspects was treated for non-life-threatening injuries at a local hospital and Kennedy declined to disclose who fired the gun or who was hurt. Neither the driver of the other vehicle nor Harris or Davis appeared to be afflicted, uh, excuse me, affiliated with the university, Kennedy said. Miles' attorney said in a statement Monday that he and his family a heartbroken tonight over the death of Jama uh, Jone Harris. While Darius has been accused of being involved with this tragedy, he maintains his innocence and looks forward to his day in court. Our firm's own investigation is ongoing and no further statement will be made at this time. On Saturday, Alabama had announced before its game against LSU that Miles would miss the rest of the season with an ankle injury. His, his bio has been removed from the athletic department website and the university said in its statement that he has been removed from campus. Alabama head coach Nate Oates said he is limited in what he can say about Miles when he spoke to the reporters in a brief news conference in Tuscaloosa on Monday. I just want to start today by offering my deepest condolences to the family and friends of Jama Jamis. I'm a Jama uh, Harris, excuse me, a young woman, a daughter, and a mother who was taken away too soon in a senseless act. He said, "It is an incredible." incredibly sad situation we're keeping Harris family and friends in our thoughts and prayers as they continue to grieve with this being a pending investigation there is nothing I can add that has already hasn't already been shared Oaks and Miles was away from the team last month as he dealt with a personal challenge and then an ankle injury continued to nab him excuse me, nag him, and eventually led him to the decision to end his season Saturday, just hours before the shooting. He's act he actually went back to, uh, home to Washington to deal with a personal matter 
and then he had the ankle injury. It was kind of ongoing. Oates said his fam he had family multiple issues. Uh, they were completely unrelated to this incident Saturday, Sunday morning. Excuse me. Uh, awakened Sunday morning with the news of the shooting, Oak said he called Alabama Athletic Director Greg Bride and uh, focused on Harris's family, uh, her family, and her uh, his team. He said the shooting resonated with him because he uh, has daughters, but he also had to talk to Miles' mother about what happened too. Oak said Miles is the only member of the Alabama team connected to the shooting. He said his team met Sunday night and they were there were a lot of hugs. In a video posted to AL.com, an emotional Miles can be heard saying, I swear I love you more than you imagine to someone as he is escorted into a law enforcement vehicle. Miles had participated in six games this season, the last time he played for the fourth-ranked Crimson Tide. On December 20th, he scored two points in Alabama's 84-64 win over Jackson State. And that is the end of the article as it goes. And, you know, basically, it's not a lot of details that's being put out. Um, how they were caught, how they, you know, said, you know, these are the guys. Um, this is an ongoing investigation, so there's not really too many details that's going on. Um, you just one of those situations where you'll just have to wait and see what pans out, what the evidence is against them, and uh, will they have a strong enough case to be able to fight against these charges? Um, who knows? Uh, it just seems like, to me, he got an ankle injury, and you know, you know, he had family issues that he was dealing with. And then you turn around and then he shoots somebody. That's a really big jump from having an ankle issue and, you know, family issues. You know, so I, I'm i just as stumped as everybody else. But I look forward to finding out the details as they be made available. And until then, you know, it's not really too much that you can say. Uh, condolences to the person, Miss Harris, uh, who lost her life. I, my condolences to her and her family. Um, you know, I hope that the killer are caught, and or if in fact it comes out that you know, um, you know, the people that's arrested that had something to do with it. You know, I guess they have to take that charge. So, uh, with that, I'm going to end this video. Please drop down in the comment section and let me know how you feel about this story. And uh, let's chop it up. And um, thank you so much. I do appreciate you for watching this video, truly. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. And with that, I will get with you in the next one.